we understand that kids love dolls, okay? So basically, they love the dolls of these nuts right here, okay? I'm telling these kids, oh I'm sorry. <laughs> what your this face? Is like the worst <laughs> parent ever. What? You literally said they can love the dolls of these nuts to a child. <laughs> Welcome to the Real and Real Pod. My name is David, and I am here with my very gorgeous looking where men stop and stare co host Eve. Yay! We're blessed with their presence. Thank you so much. No. Yes. Awesome. Okay. Here on the Real and Real, we take a concept of character from a movie and ask the question what if it or they were in the real world? We take five minutes to come with three points each and then we discuss. Eve, tell us what the question is today. The question we have for you today on the podcast that we are recording for you (laughs) (laughs) is going to be, what if all dolls went to heaven? What if all, (laughs) (laughs) what if all dolls, you know, for a second, okay, what if all dolls were possessed? Prayed to see our beloved girl again. The contact started small. Wanted permission to move into a doll so that it could be with us forever. In honor of the movie Annabelle 2, but you know what? For some reason, I as soon as I read the question, I was about to say, they make it another Chucky. <laughs> That's all I thought of. I probably, I completely forgot about Annabelle. Wow. Yeah. So, do you want to see this movie? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> if it was Chucky, probably. Oh, so it has nothing to do with you just don't want to feel like, Yeah, I don't care about Annabelle. Okay. From what I heard It's good. I don't do horror films. Mm -hmm. But here's what I don't understand. I put it on Instagram. So if you don't follow us on Instagram, go check it out on Instagram. But I said this. Real and Real Pod. Real and Real Pod on Instagram. Go find us. Okay, here's the thing. That wasn't a selfish plug. That's just the fact of what happened with this statement, this thought. If you want to hear extra thoughts from us that aren't necessarily audio clips and just random funny things about movies, go follow us on Instagram. You'll have fun. But anyway, so here's what I don't get, okay? Mm Mm-hmm. These parents had a child. She died because she was, like, picking something off the street or something and got hit by a car. With with the doll? No. I don't remember that. Okay. Maybe. I have no idea. Mm -hmm. Probably, I guess so. But anyway, she gets hit, okay, and then they are, like, sad, and they're praying, like, please, God, bring us back our baby, because I guess... Oh, they want her to, like, come back alive. Yeah. I don't know how that works. I mean, I believe in Jesus. (laughs) Go ahead. But I think people... It's a Christian on Instagram. Yeah, it's a Christian on Instagram. That's where the name comes from. But I don't know if you could pray someone back to life. Though I'm sure you're supposed to feel that faith. But when your kid passes away, unless Jesus is walking on earth, I don't think, you know, I can pray you back to life. That's not... Nah, not a thing. If genies can't bring you back to life or make people fall in love, then... Genies can't bring you back to life and make you fall in love. No, they can't. You can't wish that. Who made up these rules? <laughs> Aladdin. Exactly. You following Disney rules. <laughs> Losers. But anyway, um, so they pray or whatever. They're like, please bring it back <laughs> or whatever. Or so whatever. they start getting notes and stuff mm-hmm. talking about, you know, hey, mommy or whatever. Okay. Mm-hmm. So they they think that's their child. They somehow put what they think is their child's spirit in the body of the, in the doll. Mm-hmm. Even though it looks like a child is running around. But anyway... So it's a demon. It's not their actual daughter's spirit, right? They accidentally put a demon. They bring this a demon is the story of Annabelle. This is, this is what I see in the trailer. This is a trailer. Oh. Right? So they put the demon back in the doll. But here's what I don't get. They find out it's not their child. They lock the doll up, right? Lock it up? We they didn't lock burn it up. It? Nope, no burning. Just lock the doll up, okay? Okay. So then they're like, to repent for our sins of what we had done, we went and got a group of homeless kids and a nun. <laughs> <laughs> and we're like, come into our house. We don't want you to be homeless. But the doll's still there. <laughs> Your thought process was let what what that makes what? sense. You know what? I felt bad for putting you in jail for lighting your house on fire. We're gonna let you work at a match factory <laughs> and see how things go there. Like, what sense did this make? It, who keeps who? Ah, it's just 
Dumb. I hate it. Mm-hmm. Anyway, uh, it just sounds. It sounds stupid. But it's not about the plot. It's about being scared and all the stuff. And I heard it's actually pretty good. If you, I think the only review out right now is Chris Stuckman. If you don't know who that is, go on YouTube, type in Chris Stuckman, <laughs> two ends, and you'll see a review for it. It's out early. But anyway, let's get to this. Let's do it. Three points in five minutes. What if all dolls were possessed? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> And we're back. Hello, welcome back. Yeah. Sound like some smooth jazz. <laughs> Just so you know, don't know what you're listening to us on, but you can also listen to us on YouTube, SoundCloud, TuneIn, Stitcher, Google Play, and iTunes. You can also follow us, like we said earlier, on Instagram and Twitter. Everything's at Real and Real Pod. Now, back to the show. What if all dolls were possessed? Go Ladies ahead, first. Man. So my first point... Barbies would become assassins for the government, okay? This, because originally my point was that Barbie, the company, would go out of business because people would be too frightened to purchase that. That makes more sense. I right. like that point better. I did too. But then I was like, Mm-mm, let's take it a step further because Barbie ain't going to go out like that. So The company. Right. Okay. So we're like, okay, the public doesn't want our dolls. No. But you know who does? No. Assassins, killers. Those Why that are would a killer to, want a doll instead of using a killer? Because dolls, they're like, you still have people that don't believe that these dolls are truly possessed because they haven't encountered them. They've heard and the how stories. Can you, how can you, know? you control the possessed doll? How do you control anything? Manipulation. You're going to manipulate a doll? Hey, okay. people manipulated worse. What? What? People manipulated Chucky? Huh? No, that ain't happened. Yeah. Because Chucky liked the boy, didn't he? He just hated his parents. I didn't watch Chucky. I don't know. No. <laughs> <laughs> and then Chucky got married. Come on now. Like, that does not mean he was manipulated. That means he just that, that domesticated means, himself. <laughs> there's, there's some feelings in there somewhere. <laughs> that mean anything. So dolls have feelings now? That's what they teach us. What? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't play with dolls when I was younger. so I did not either. <laughs> You want to go with the Barbies company would go out of business? No, I don't like either one of your points. I mean, I like the Barbies company would go out of business. It makes more sense. I mean, there's not much you can expound upon that. Yeah, point. that's about it. That's all there was. That's why I was like, let me take your a step assassins. Out. Just makes no sense whatsoever. I understand. So you can have from previous episodes, if y'all have listened, you can have baby suicide bombers, but I can't have Barbie assassins. That was then at that time. This is mm-hmm. a whole new week. Okay, new week of assassins. You're living in the past. <laughs> okay, come to the present where. <laughs> Think of a more creative. Come on, think point. about it. You got you gonna have Barbie, the original Barbie, and her Malibu pink whip convertible. Who are they killing? Well, see, I was thinking. Um, I was about to say traitors, um, terrorists. Okay, we're going into Sudan, right? <laughs> driving, <laughs> driving in the pink, um, whatever kind of car she got. It's a. Is it a Cadillac? No. No. What? I don't know. I just. It's a top. That's a convertible. That's all I know. It's a convertible. What is that? Thing? I don't. That's a good question. Cadillac. What? Barbie in a Cadillac? <laughs> top down. Like <laughs> I don't think that's a thing. Cadillac. Yeah. It's like a little Cadillac. Do Cadillacs even make convertibles? sports car convertibles like that? I don't think so. Uh, that's a good point. At least, no, definitely not back then. No, it'd be a big Maybe car. Maybe like a Chrysler. You think that's what she had? No. She, what it, she it, have? it definitely was. It's not a Honda or a Nissan. No. That's a good question. Is what Malibu? Bre- a, what is, is, is what Malibu kind of car does? A car? <laughs> oh, Mal. No, the Chevy. Chevy, Chevy has Malibu. a Malibu. Yeah. Huh. I thought they just called it a com- Barbie's convertible. It was Barbie's convertible always. That's it. But what kind of convertible did Barbie have? I don't think she had an emblem in that. She didn't have licensing. No, <laughs> okay. they definitely did it. But anyways, all right, you got Barbie in the convertible, right? Boom. She rolling up into she rolling up into Zand. Saudi Arabia. <laughs> Boom. Even better. Okay, we're in the city driving. Nobody's <laughs> thinking nothing. <laughs> no. Wait, 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 wait. No one's thinking nothing that's, about a doll. Just driving. Because you just see this little. You like, oh, that's a toy. Maybe a kid just pushed it and it just hasn't stopped yet all right you drive it boom you drive it we're getting into the in the desert where is the right. kid <laughs> nobody's in the shop. and we're speeding too where is the kid hey, that's what everyone that's the question that's why she's able to they just drive blow that thing up from like a distance no nah, we just drive it boom now we're in the but desert but you only get one off though that's the thing okay one does it right one then word gets out like oh barbies are coming to assassinate us Gotta no because see this is how you're gonna spend the story what? okay because we're gonna take control of it first and say people are using toys as bombs okay Not then that. they will stop 
They was they would shoot them on sight though. Exactly. But that ends that rain. They can't do it anymore then. But then we gotta get more creative, okay? So they're saying toys, but we're not going to the extent people are thinking, come on, really toys, you know? So maybe I'm pretty sure everybody takes Barbie's bombing convertible. To a serious, to Barbie's a serious convertible extent. is driving by itself. I think now. they'll be specific, like a doll in a convertible um, car mm-hmm. blew us up. No, I wouldn't know. Because everybody's know. mind is like, where's the kid that pushed the convertible? Exactly. They'd be like... They'd be looking for the kid. But eventually, everybody knows that dolls are possessed. It's a worldly known thing. Um, Yeah, that's just... That's something. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> uh, my first point is that, obviously, in connection with the movie, there would be more traveling pastors. Right. To exercise the baby. I mean, not the baby. The doll. <laughs> the baby. The doll. I'm exercise sorry. the doll. Is the exorcism not just setting them aflame? No. What? It's no. It's a doll. You act like it's a human, right? We can put all them You're things t- in people, one house. I want my doll, okay? My kid wants their doll. Exercise, get the demon out. Kid, kid will die with it, too, if that's the case. What? You're going to burn on. a kid? I'm saying, if we going back to, like, Salem witch trials, We're right? not. We are now. Okay, this is now know. in this age, okay? No. My pastors, they're like, we understand, we understand that kids love dolls, okay? So, basically. People love the dolls of these nuts right here, okay? I'm telling these kids. Oh I'm sorry. <laughs> Your this face. Is like the worst <laughs> parent ever. What? You literally said they can love the dolls of these nuts to a child. <laughs> Mom, I want a doll. I want to love it. You can love the dolls of these nuts. That's what you just said <laughs> to a three year old. <laughs> Why? And that three year old <laughs> cried. Like if you were Santa Claus, Santa. <laughs> For Christmas, I want a doll. And then Santa replied, you can love the doll of these nuts. Love Santa. That's what you just said to a kid. That is horrible. Why? See, if I could be guilty and into stuff, that would make me feel so bad. You should feel bad. That is horrible. What? I want to see you. You know what? I want to I want to I want to take this example and put it in the real world. I want to see you say that to a child. Go to a child and say that. And see I would that say child, that. No, I believe you won't. If I told if I, I told a child can, no. that Santa Claus and the Easter Bunny One, I think you tag can... teamed and killed the two fairies. No. I would But tell... that's different. That's different. No. That's like so fantastical. You told a child. <laughs> you can love the doll of these nuts. You know how much is in that statement? You know how much is in that statement? Why are one, you so focused on that? doll. Okay, you t- you one you you insulted a child to their face, right? You were you were, you, you were like rude to a child. What? You were very mean. Then you referenced your body parts. <laughs> Which sounds like pedophilia, <laughs> and then body parts that you don't have. Oh, no. So you reference a man's body parts. What the hell? So much is going into this. Like transgender people are upset what? about this. Like there's a lot to go in this statement. My goodness. No. My See, goodness. No. Was where no. you're taking it too no. literal. No. All right. I'm just it's saying. It's not that deep. Dude, okay. My, my all goodness. All right. <laughs> My goodness, that is that is tragic. That is tragic. It is tragic. But uh, yeah, back to my pastors, the more holy version of this statement. Um, I think people Not want... Not holy. It's rectifying the situation. No, no, mm-hmm. no. If you had a choice between the doll or you, who are you going to go with? What do you mean? Why am I choosing? Exactly. My pastor's coming out. Throw that doll. He's going to exercise the doll, okay? Into the and flames. And get the demon out. In the Done. flames of hell. Then that demon's floating around in the sky. <laughs> To be possessed to, to, someone to, else. to possess somebody else. Look mm. at that. Shame. So there Shame you go. on that pastor. Shame. Exactly. No, so this the is pastor's what we're coming do. to save everybody. You people. Take your brain and to save you people. It's Actually, be... oh my gosh. Speaking of, um, uh, not speaking of. So the show Castlevania I was telling you about, right? Mm-hmm. There's this like pastor in quotes mm-hmm. who's like running the town, whatever. He's like horrible. Okay. Mm-hmm. Like he's horrible to the point where demons come into the to church. Like oh. and he's like, you can't be in here. This is the house of God. And then the demon's like, God is not here. Like he ain't here right he now. Like, he's like, you, what you do, do for you. No, he's like, what you do makes God puke. I was like, oh, this is dope. So then one of the guys says, like one of the, the good guys was mm-hmm. like, oh, we need to fight these demons. I need a pastor, a real one, ordained in a church. <laughs> like we know there's some fake dudes out here. <laughs> I right. need the real kind. Then he mm-hmm. gave him some water. He was like, here's some water. You know what to do with this, right? Make it holy. Okay, here we go. <laughs> like, it was like legit. Love that. Oh, my gosh. If you haven't seen that show, go see that show. Heck but yeah. anyway, they're going to have the pastors come out to the dolly's house, right? The doll got a whole house by itself or to the house of the... the... Pe- well, I mean, you might have a doll house. I don't know. See, I'm thinking this is how you do it, right? Go back. Ancient Egypt, right? You're going too far back. No, this no. is now. No, no. I'm just saying examples. Ancient Egypt. Remember Pharaoh? He said kill all the firstborns, the males, because he was trying to find Moses, right? Wasn't that the story? Mm, 
no, I think he was just killing all the firstborns. Me- Moses, he was not trying to find Moses because he didn't know of Moses. Oh, okay. He was just trying to kill all firstborns. Okay, Yeah, boom. so they so didn't rise up and everyone, uh, attack them. we must um, Burn possess. All the dolls? No, first we, we must repossess your dolls. Okay. If you can. They're demonized dolls. True. True. You got to catch them. Mm. Mm. You know, I'm thinking more like there's a they, they take all the dolls, right? Doll squad. They take all the dolls. Mm-hmm. They put them in a room. Well, in a, in a factory. In a, a factory. House. Put them back in a factory. What and then house? one by one, you chain them up, mm-hmm. bring them into a room. The pastor exercises them, sends the Why doll back out. Why just them Because kids want dolls, man. The, the dolls. Anyway, moving on. What's your <laughs> next point? What's your next point? Okay, so my next point is, now I know people think of being possessed as a negative thing, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the only time I could see it being a positive thing that I can think of mm-hmm. was Yu-Gi-Oh! Because he was a little scrawny little boy, and all of a sudden he couldn't get something. He couldn't, like, win the battle. Ah, oh, snap, I need, to, I need to tag out. Yu-Gi-Oh! All of a sudden, hello. Like he, his, his voice get deeper. He seems a little taller. He was taller. Got a little, got got, got, to him. Got a little, got a little weight on him. Girls looking at him like, hey, maybe you should stay in this uh, form. What's up with your Yu-Gi-Oh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna use that line on Oculus Rift now. I'm gonna be like, what's up with your Yu-Gi-Oh? Though. <laughs> I feel bad for your boyfriend. Um, <laughs> Tell me this morning I have problems. Yeah, I'm glad he knows. I'm <laughs> glad he knows. I'm glad he's not surprised about it. Okay, but go ahead. Yes. Uh, yeah. What, what were you talking oh, about? Oh, you were talking about you. Oh, possession. Yeah, and possession. You, you said, yeah, that's the only good one I know. So what good one? So you? I'm thinking, okay, being possessed actually means being possessed by a spirit. Yes. Good or bad. Okay. okay. All right. All right. Mm-hmm. So I'm thinking, all right, we have some good possessions and we have some bad possessions. How do you know, though? You want to take that gamble of the bad one pretending they're good and then doing evil stuff while you're not looking? Well, see, this is what I was thinking, okay? You're thinking you about to get murdered. <laughs> I'm thinking that we're going to have a doll association of butlers, okay? So that way we'll help employ them, make them feel we a little empowered. We need to start filming this, this, uh, this show because... You my, said what? You need to start filming this show so, I can, so people can see my face. <laughs> When you say the stupidest things. No, ever. go with me now, okay? I don't want to go. You got I feel the like dolls. if I keep going, I'm going to just go crazy. You got the dolls, right? They're possessed. But they're like, I'm possessed by your old grandma. You know, I want to love you. Supposedly. Baby. Supposedly. I'd be like, tell me something about my grandma. But well, then they could have tortured my grandma in the spirit world. I don't trust them. Like, baby, I'm here for you. And so now. My grandma never said, baby. Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> now, grandma spirit in the doll, she cooking you breakfast. She the doll can cook breakfast? Yes, yes. We're cooking breakfast. We're slicing up strawberries. Put them, putting them with the French toast. Speaking of, that, I don't even like strawberries you... on my French toast. In your face, my grandma would know that. Stab, stab, stab. You just, like, you just like plain French toast, don't you? Yeah, I do. Yeah. No, I like cinnamon French toast. Who doesn't like cinnamon French toast? Oh, Isn't okay, that how it's made? It has cinnamon. Is that regular it. French toast? No, I mean I think that that's that is French toast. That's just plain. Cinnamon is the French toast. Right? Yes. Okay, I was about to say, is there French toast without cinnamon? <laughs> and if you're eating that, I'm sorry. <laughs> You need to stop. <laughs> Get your life together. But back, whose point were we on? Yours or mine? Oh, yes. So I'm giving my dolls jobs, okay? They're becoming butlers. And I was thinking maybe masseuses because they're tiny. So they can really put all their oomph into that massage and things. Don't make that face. I don't think because you're tiny, you can put more oomph. I think because you're tiny, you can't put more oomph. You have no weight to you. We're possessed. We can drag. We can. <laughs> <laughs> We can put in, we can do a run and jump, you know, walk on the back, really put the elbows, the little fingers heels, we can get to the crevices of the muscles. You know, that's what I was thinking. Okay, maybe not masseuses, but <laughs> they can definitely cook. They can definitely cook and clean, okay? They can dust. So now we have a whole possessed doll butler service. The BPD, the the. One is starts DB, with a P. Right. It's possessed. <laughs> the D. No, P. Possessed. No, I said the dolls possessed butlers. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So DPB. The, yeah. The Why DPB. is it so hard for you to get acronyms so quickly that you made it the name? <laughs> oh. Sat. <laughs> the DBs or the PDs. I think that's different the than PDs. what you think it is. Yeah, I like the PDs. Possessed Dolls Incorporated. Okay. So, moving on from your you What's your next point? Okay. So, my awesome. in this world, right? Dolls are uh, banned oh. from, of course, movie theaters. 
No. <laughs> what? I was wondering about when you were going to catch up to the masses. <laughs> it made no <laughs> sense. You're like, no, wait. No, that definitely... Okay, continue. Anyway, dolls are obviously banned at a wide variety because they're possessed. From Walmart. Evil possessed. So, of course, it's hard to get a ta- you know, get get one, right? But here's the thing. You need a permit. I think kids mm-hmm. are somehow getting the dolls, but not to have for their own. Mm-hmm. Okay. Are they becoming is... like illegal drugs? <laughs> no, 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 no. No, I mean, kind of. But no, here's what happens, right? Mm-hmm. You don't want to get a possessed doll because they're evil. They want to kill you, all that good stuff. I mean, mm-hmm. all that bad stuff. I have some drama with somebody who might be somewhat of a bully in my class, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Every year, some schools do a secret Santa. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's say I get their name. I give them a possessed doll. Bam. So, no, now dolls are becoming like, it's like marijuana. No, it's more like a voodoo doll, like a curse. Like I'm sending you a curse. But no, you said it's harder for them to get a hold of, right? Like a curse, yes. <laughs> Well, no, I feel like a curse is pretty easy. I to- think curses are pretty hard. Can, do no. you know where to get a curse? Can you go somewhere and get a curse right now? I don't think so. I think you got to Google where do I go get curses. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there are like curse shops walk, like in little plazas. I don't think Walmart has a curse section in their little store. No, see, I no. think it's hard to get a curse. So that's my point. I'm going to say <laughs> that kids are gifting other kids with dolls for the kids that they don't like. Okay. Like, here you go in your face. It's like, mm-hmm. oh, what did you get me, loser? And then, mm-hmm. uh, oh, no, a doll. And, like, it attaches to you or something. And it's like, ah, you've been possessed. Like, ah, What does it do, you. eat you? Like, what is it? Just make your life miserable somehow. I don't know. Uh, make water fall in your See, head. I have no now, idea now, if we just do. stuck with my whole. Make you feel like you're suffocating or something. Yeah, these dolls are possessed. They have spirits inside of them. Go inside your was- body. Slam your body into the wall. Go back inside the doll. The doll? The, the doll. What's the doll going to go down your throat? How's it getting yes. inside of you? <laughs> it's spirit comes out the doll and goes into you and then makes you slam into the wall. Oh, so we're like the, the transfer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But it's only there to hurt you. It's a hurting doll. Unlike my helping dolls. Exactly. Opposite. Look at that. Look at you. Mm-hmm. 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 Yep. Evil. Evil. You. Evil. Uh, I'm not the one to tell little kids. <laughs> They can basically suck your balls. <laughs> I'm just selling them between the doll and you. Nope. Choose the what's doll. Your name? I mean, what's, no. what's, what's your <laughs> <laughs> no. Between the doll and you, choose the doll because your mama don't love you no more. Just letting you know. Right. Because you get kidnapped. She ain't trying to find you. She's going to have another one. Well, then my last point is simple. Dolls will become like, the dolls are like, dolls will become illegal to have. It'll be like marijuana in certain states. You can't just be having dolls all out willy nilly, just going and buying them. You know, willy nilly, right? You know, you can't so, have dolls out all <laughs> willy nilly. <laughs> you know, you gotta have you're gonna have a gonna have a doll dealer. You know, there'll be doll dealers for those that want to have possessed dolls because people are into some freaky things. You know, or they may want to kill someone, like you said, or go possess somebody. So you have doll dealers because dolls will be illegal. That sounds so dumb. Like, uh, I just think of a guy opening up his trunk. <laughs> full of dolls? <laughs> full of dolls. Not creepy, that sounds. And they all have to be, oh, they'll be, like, chained, uh, like, by the throat and, like, What? I hands. figured they were just be in boxes, like, at a toy store. No, nah, if they're possessed, they can get out of that. We need some, like, And the chains is duty. okay? The chains is something. Well, who wants... And salt. Who wants <laughs> demonic dolls? I guess demonic people. Never mind. Yeah, exactly. I got them dolls on the Anytime level. you have to question I got Barbie why, class five. means you're just not on that level. With the Malibu car. Exactly. <laughs> the possessed Malibu car. Mm-hmm. And a chicken bone. <laughs> exactly. And inside that car is a bomb. What? Why? It could level an entire city. People want these things. You want that with the possessed doll? Yeah, because the possessed doll is driving a car. Done. Exactly. That city is done for. I'm happy you just you on the same wavelength. Honey. No, what are you? What? You're no. right there. No, no, we are not on any wavelength <laughs> ever. Okay. So what's so your next point? What's your last point? Last I, point. I have my one. You got to come after that. Kind of sucks because it's on my phone. Basically, I said the dolls would be sold on the black market. <laughs> oh, but I can't have a doll dealer though. 
No, not with the bomb thing. It's kind of weird, but um. Okay, no, you know, real. I mean, no the more bombs. you said it and you kept going, I was like, this sounds even worse and worse. I can't like divert from what I already wrote. <laughs> so that was my last point. But mine's not like yours. Mine is like what do you mean? Because yours is like <laughs> weird. My no. mine's more like a loving parent knows that their kid wants a specific doll. Goes on the black market, underground, pays for that doll, takes it to wherever it needs. Because you got to go to a couple people to exchange hands to get the doll how you need the doll. Like, first, the dolls only come possessed. You got to get the possessed doll. Then you take the possessed doll to, like, a shaman or something, like some some monk for, like, a month or something. Let you also got way too many steps. Hey, man, this is for my kid. So it's for the monk. The monk does whatever it needs to do to take out the possession. Then you take it to a pass, and then you throw some holy water. You let it soak in the holy water for, like, a year or something. And then after that, then you take it to like the highest part of the mountain and then I don't know like throw pray. it off <laughs> like and it pray just... or something then you, yeah you can throw it off right it's like it's like it's dying again and being resurrected anew like you catch it with a helicopter no. or something and then you take it and then get it like washed up cleaned up everything's good give it to your kid no. in about four to five Christmases bam Merry Christmas Tommy or Jillian whoever is getting the doll you're welcome. Dad went through See, a lot to get that for you. mine is way simpler. Go ahead and get your, Bal- your Malibu Barbie and nope, her Malibu, nope, you're trying to blow her Malibu mine convertible is so sweet. from the doll dealer down the street. His mine name is, so is Johnny. Sweet. Okay. And let him work homie. You feel me? Anyway. <laughs> yeah. Like, you just you got to go here and go off the cliff of the Himalayas. And I'm not doing this. It's too much. Like, why would we do all that? We don't want to do all that. When you kill someone, you want it to be quick and simple. What? I don't want to. <laughs> Let's go on our points, please. What were mine? Do you remember? Okay. No, I tried to forget as this. soon as they entered to my brain. Um, First one, Barbies will become Barbies, the company, all right? They would turn their dolls into assassins for the government, all right? Um, Malibu, Malibu Barbie being the head of it. Next one, we got... PDs, all right? Possessed Dolls Incorporated. These are good dolls doing butler services for you, all right? You're welcome. Around the house, cooking up, doing their thing. And my last point, dolls will become illegal, so now we would have to have doll dealers. Instead of drug dealers, doll dealers. Mm-hmm. Okay. PDs. My points were that there would be more traveling pastors to exercise the dolls. So Lame. To, thank you. My <laughs> second point... <laughs> Is that high school kids would gift other kids with evil dolls that they don't like because they were being jerks. Because they got it from my doll dealer. There you go. Whatever. <laughs> uh, and my last point is that they'd be sold in the black market, but to loving parents <laughs> who have to what? go through processes <laughs> to give their kid the doll eventually after it's been, like, demon removed. And that's the show. Eve, where can they find you? You guys can go and find my humorous funniness. You said it as if you tweet a lot. I know, right? I don't know. <laughs> I know it at all. Like, I'm on social media a lot at all. But I'm thinking, come Labor Day, I will be. Might be lying. It's going to be Miss Lovely score. No. <laughs> Great job. Miss Lovely underscore. Come on, say it with me. Curse. Curse. And then you have David. I do tweet. All uh, the time. Recently, it's... And on Instagram. Yeah, recently, no, I don't. That's just me. But recently, it's less than my tweets come from my my account. So just follow the what the Instagram because that's where most of my because usually I'm saying jokes from my own account. Uh-huh. Now the jokes are just eloqu- you know dedicated toward the actual show instead of me making jokes of my own on my own. Can I know. say something? Sure. I embellished my height on a dating site, and the girl said she couldn't trust me. Aladdin lies about everything and still gets the girl. So only lying about being a prince is okay. Yeah, that's true. Mm-hmm. That's what truly mm-hmm. happened. You got 35 likes. I did get 35 likes. Not enough. We need more likes. Like us to Like, death. subscribe, and share. All that, girl. Oh, my. And um, have a great guy. I mean, have a great guy. Have a great day, guys. I uh, hope you have uh, fun doing whatever you're doing, and I hope you laugh today. Well, I know you laugh. giant poop. Cool. The emoji movie, I assume. Oh, was there poop in there? There's every emoji in there, yes. Uh. I couldn't watch the emoji movie because no black emojis. <laughs>
Oh, really? I feel like somebody said that. I don't know. Oh, I was just making them Come on now. I saw that. None of the black emojis now, so come on. I don't believe in black emojis because they weren't white before. They were they were jaundice emojis. <laughs> Looking like they the were Simpsons. yellow. Yeah, they were yellow. Right. But everyone's sensitive. But anyway, thanks for listening, guys. Hope you have a great day. Bye.